a dope costume and she was like and walked away this girl didn't say thank you okay nothing. now you're changing the story you're changing the story because previously and every other time besides now you was like i know she might have said i know y'all it's See, been some, this story it's is, been some, it's, it's no it's fictional no it's and Nini and today we're gonna do a highly requested video of how we met but we're gonna do it a little bit different so we're gonna ask each other to see if we can remember how we met and then we'll explain all the confusion at the end um we have our like boxes and it has our names on it of course mine will be turned incorrectly I know y'all gonna know me as Nini this is my real name if y'all can pronounce it you know Write the pronunciation in the comments and we'll see who has it right. But I'm known as Nini, so that's fine. Okay. All right, so let's go. <laughs> okay, so, and now we begin. Yep, yeah, go ahead. You, you want me to go first? Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm gonna take it nice and easy on you. I got this for the first anyway. So. Okay, for the first question, it's gonna be easy. Oh, we have our good friend Pinnacue here. It is alcohol alcoholic beverage, but it's only 17%. But just make sure you're 21 and older. Right. And you know, it's not a sponsored video or anything, but we do like to drink, so what else? Right. All right, nice and easy. What year did we officially? meet officially meet officially so not like oh i saw you or you saw me i heard about you you heard about me what year did we officially meet hey i'm nini i mean my that's easy okay <laughs> so that's easy okay all right don't be cheating either. i'm not gonna cheat don't be even looking at how i'm making my numbers either I'm not. I'm writing it so that they know that I already have my number down. Okay, let's see. You oh, didn't great. have to write it. Only I had to write it. You you write the answer to your question because you're going to say it out loud. And I write the answer to my question. Oh, uh, okay. So that we can ensure that I'm not changing my answer. That makes sense. That no one's changing the answer. All right, let me know when you're ready. Sure. I'm ready. 2014. <laughs> <laughs> she got it right. You have to write backwards going further. All right. <laughs> okay, get there. All right. <clears throat> how we met, how we met. Where were we when we officially met each other? Like, hey, I'm Nini. Hey, I'm Monty. That's kind of difficult, but I'm going to answer it still. But that's difficult because... It happened a few times. Right. But I'm going to answer it still as in the absolute first place. I don't know if you're gonna take this as that because it was like a general introduction versus a personal one. Okay. I'm gonna still do it because this is my recollection. Okay. <laughs> All right. What you doing? Okay. All right. I don't remember the exact abbreviations like WBSB, whatever it's the science building in like the um, conference room at college. And we both went to like a formal meeting for the sorority that we joined. And that's what we like officially met. All right. I said your apartment and I did not write backwards. And that's because this is why I feel like this was more official because we all came back to your apartment and we sat in a circle and we mm -hmm. went around legit introducing ourselves, who we were and all that. While that is very true, like I said, there's <laughs> multiple instances that you could write it. That we could have said, but I was trying to take it to the like first, 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 like where did I meet this girl at? Since we're talking about like how it started, but we and said that's why official I introduction, and I, that was an official introduction. I found out, you know, three truths and a lie about her and everything. The interest meeting, yeah, interest meeting. That's what it's called. So I found out, you know, a good bit of information about her. Now, truthfully, I didn't go there to find this out about her. I just happened to have, you know, so. 
I'll drink to that, but I do want y'all to know I did tell the truth. And we don't have shot glasses, so don't be judging us. We don't have shot glasses because is this a new one or not? Because this is giving me too much energy. We mm -hmm. wanted to show y'all like how this drink really works, like how it functions. Cause you could they have like little shot bottles of these, which we could have. Maybe it was just me. We could have brought those up too, because we have some of those. But they want you to drink out of it like it's an actual pineapple. So you actually factually hold it. And this pineapple can stand on its own. It's pretty cool. Like, just like on the table or whatever. Like, it just stands up. But you can just hold it like it's a pineapple and drink it like it's okay. Again, this video is not sponsored, but try it out. See how you like it. I don't need it. Mm -hmm. I didn't lose. Yeah. Okay. You twisted that one? Yeah. All right, go ahead. Take your time, because I know it took, it took a time. This one, it's not tricky, but you're going to have to think, but not too much. You should get off of that, but it's a good question. Where were we when we first got confronted together about the status of our relationship? <laughs> I'm good. Don't write it. <laughs> I write it. Okay. Ready? Yeah. All right. We were in Miller Arms, Tasha's apartment. <laughs> On the couch. You guys. But I legit wrote Miller Arms, Taj apartment. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. I legit wrote that. What's crazy is I could have said Taj's apartment in Miller Arms, but I didn't. Like, right. <laughs> That's funny. All right. So, okay. our LS, who is our tail. Sorry, our line sister, who is our tail. We, were, we used to stay at her house a lot when we, um joined the sorority so after joining the sorority um we were there you know just all together like it's like a new sisterhood you have and imani and i's relationship was obviously more close than everybody else's and they were just starting to like side eye us and they really was like what's really going on with y'all and <laughs> we weren't there yet and the reason why we weren't there yet was for many reasons but the main reason was neither one of us was openly lesbians you know like this is our first real lesbian relationship lesbian anything so i probably went too far with lesbian <laughs> anything but lesbian relationship so it was difficult for us to say and especially like to be like drug out the closet so to speak you know it was aggressive Versus, yeah it was, it was like, like it was like we walk into the house and it's our sisters waiting for us. We sit on the couch and it's like, all right, we got something to ask y'all. And it was just boom, on the spot. You know, of course right. we lie. I mean, first of all, it's not nobody's business. But we wasn't ready to say it. And how dare you guys just drag us out at this point. If we gave you a no, then it was a no. But they didn't accept a no. It was just like, so why y'all always together? So why y'all did this? Why I did that? So it was just like, okay, <laughs> this is too much. And it, it even made us become aggressive. We were like, okay, I was at one point like, okay, and if we are, who's going to do anything about it? Like, okay, we, we're together. Now what? Like, now what? You know? And it was only, we only became that aggressive and defensive because we just wasn't ready. And put on a spot. And we'll put on a spot. And they were ready for it. Like, hey, if this is what it is, tell us. Like, we're all sisters. Why are you hiding it from us? But we just weren't ready. So that was a very pivotal point in the beginning of us. Mm-hmm. Where were we when you made our relationship finally official? <laughs> when you made our relationship? <laughs> I want location. Okay. okay. That's not a trick question. She does this, okay? I just want you to peek to yourself. Excuse me. <sighs> Like, this is my wife. I'm married on purpose. I love on purpose. So, I remember everything. You know, I do too. But I I have a bad memory. I don't remember everything. She does have a bad memory. And Terrible. I have to remind her her age. But, <laughs> it's seriously. But, she's 27. And when I was 27, <laughs> this is important. When I was 27, I also... Like, my memory was terrible. I, tell me if that happened to any of y'all. Like, she would have to keep telling me how old I was. Like, it was just... Tell them how old you are now. Since you put my age out there. <laughs> you have to wait to see. <laughs> It'll come up. <laughs> Alright, in the comments, let me know how old she looks to y'all. Or how old y'all think she is. 
And y'all already have a hint. I said when I was 27. So obviously, I'm older than her. You I'm ain't older than 27. They know that. <laughs> okay. All right, go ahead. What's your answer? Um, my answer, where were we when I finally made our relationship official? Matteo's, Uncle Matteo's Pizza Place in Columbia. Okay. Uncle Matteo's. You got that. And it's... <laughs> okay how we started hmm oh my god so look i have a good question but the thing is is i was trying to tell her how we was gonna put this segment into question form and i kind of gave her the answer to this question i'm gonna still give it to you because i didn't go full force with it but whatever it's a two-part question who said i love you first and where were we? Is this a trick question? Because I definitely know the answers to that. Okay. Are you going to write it down? Oh, yeah. I forgot I'm doing the waiting right now. You done? Yeah. We, I said I love you first. Mm -hmm. And it took you about... 20 minutes to respond. That's irrelevant. That has nothing to do with the... With Maybe the longer. That's not it the question. It felt like an hour. That's not the question. Okay. And we were in my dorm room on my bed. Okay. See? I be doing stuff. But I do think we should end the, um, the question format and just talk to y'all now. Okay. It's been about 15 minutes. We can do that. No problem. But since she requested to do it, she's going to drink. <laughs> what? That don't make any sense. Yes, it does. You ended the game. You don't know who's enjoying the game, i.e. myself, or who just wants to talk. Here we go. I'm a thug. Y'all don't see this, so I'm going to drink it so y'all can see. Because you'll see in the clear part. Watch the clear part. It, this one is... um. It's made with premium rum, Dutch cream, vodka. Dutch cream and vodka. I made that up when I said Dutch cream and vodka. But it's a liqueur. 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 But it's really, it might be cure. But, but it's pronounced liqueur. liqueur. <laughs> it's pronounced liqueur. But it's um white. It's white color. But I'm going to show you it's like, like this. It's like beige yellow. It's like a creamy white. Like a um 2% milk. Hmm. I think you can look, you see it too. It looks like milk. I guess it is white, huh? Ew, nasty. <laughs> Swallow it. <Ew>! All right, <laughs> boom. We started. All right, so we both, by, by chance, went to a college that we did not plan on going to, which was Morris College in Sumter, South Carolina. At this college, I was a sophomore when we met, and she was a senior when we met. We both decided... You were a senior. Oh. Okay. <laughs> you were a second, second semester senior. All right, relax. Continue. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we pledged the best sorority there is together, and which was crazy because not trying to put your business out there. I don't know if you want it. You can cut it if you want to, but she was supposed to pledge either that previous year or two years prior, which means we would have never met, at least not met in the capacity of being together. We would have met as she would have been my big sister, not my line sister. Correct. She pledged, I pledged, we pledged together. This is where we grew our bond, okay? Because we, we've seen each other in passing. She said we met at a club one year. We did. And I don't remember that. She said I was rude. Come on. It's Very. I was, so, rude is not her personality, I'll be honest, but she was highly intoxicated. <laughs> um, She was, you know, enjoying the college life. It probably was her first real big college party. You know, and I was still going out a little bit towards my, you know, junior and senior year. I stopped going out. But <clears throat> every now and a, now and again, like big parties, which this was a Halloween party, which was a big at our college. I would go out. She went out dressed as Aliyah and she did a good job, you know. So when I saw her, I was just like, oh, like, that's dope. Like, I'm just a very social person. So I don't mind approaching anybody and say like, hey, you look nice, whatever it was nothing flirtatious. It was no, like, even interest in anything. I knew nothing about this girl, which is simply, like, 
a dope costume and she was like and walked away this girl didn't say thank you okay nothing. now you're changing the story you're changing the story because previously in every other time besides now you was like i know she might have said, "I know, y'all." It's See, been, this story it's is been some, it's, it's no, fictional. No, it's usually the same, no. but it's been a while since I told the story. This girl keeps telling me I'm lying because you are. I would I'm not. not I, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. <laughs> it was a very unpleasant experience to the point I'm like, bitch, you ain't even that cute type of thing. You know, like <laughs> it ain't that I'm serious. You know, I would not say so, that. So, y'all, I wouldn't even lie. It really but was your story's changing. This is the first time that I didn't say exactly. I know, but whatever. She still made the. Maybe I'm not getting the words exactly. What I'm telling you is, I told her outfit was cute. It was no thank you, no okay, nothing. It was simply like peasant. How I for lack of better words. I don't remember. Let's it. Continue Wait, no, 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 no. Okay, but real quick, let me just address this. What I think happened was because I truly don't know. I don't remember this encounter. I think I was intoxicated. I think she was speaking to me and I didn't hear her or know she was speaking to me. So I could have looked at her like, are you talking to me? Are you not? Okay, maybe not. Let me just walk away. I don't remember that. But my personality, I would I would thank you. Like, I would overthink you. I would not say. So I was not I highly know, intoxicated. Or not I completely remember what happened. And I looked dead at your face. She like, was, it was a deal. It was, I'm like, dang, she looked dope. Me and my friends, to include my younger sister, who remembers it exactly as I do. <laughs> stopped her in the club we practically at this point surround her because a group was coming towards me they weren't lined up behind me we were beside each other and it's like hey you look dope you did good with the Leah outfit like she had the Leah on the back and everything i'm like hey you look dope you know and i don't remember that anyway keep, keep going okay we're at this interest me and they're like hey everybody you knew interestees or whatever they're calling us at this point you know like thanks for coming in let's all introduce ourselves so we want you to stand up tell us who you are and then they were doing like icebreaker games like tell me a three truths and a lie let's try to guess which one is a lie you know stuff like that so we can get to know each other yeah after this interest meeting during i'm gonna say during let me stop you there okay. i noticed her okay she said she don't remember me i almost remember what you were wearing i remember how your hair was and i remember your three truths two truths and a lie i remembered you girl you stood out right now i don't know about stand out or anything but what i can say is honestly i did not remember her and it was not anything against her it was just that i was at this interest meeting finally of something that i wanted to do i was there with two of my other friends who we like kind of vowed to do it together we waited for each other like we're finally here together so we were just kind of focused on each other and i wasn't focused on anything else like my mind was one track minded so when we met at that point i knew everybody in the room or knew of everybody in the room and i realized she was in the room but i wasn't thinking of anything else besides the fact of what i'm here for and like looking at our friends like ah, we're finally doing it you know that's how i felt all right guys so that's how we met and if you want to hear about how we almost didn't make it or all the juicy details in between of how we got to where we are now make sure you like comment share and subscribe and just let us know what you want and we'll be sure to give it to you we love you